you can't touch me. And I just kind of like hit him. <laughs> so you, and, you, and you did what Cloud excelled at, just smacking him. Yeah, no, he was what like, the, oh, I'm going to up the air dodge me. And I was like, you can't do that. I'm out of percent. And I just jumped away. Is it? Yeah. He, Good man. Yeah. It's bl bless you, Chris. Um, <laughs> bless Chris. We're going to this. And so, so we're yeah. Interesting. Okay, okay then. So the double blind walking out for dinosaurs here. Mm -hmm. This is very interesting, and I'm surprised. I'm actually kind of surprised that Danny is elected to start with his Rosa. If he was expecting uh, Bowser or something, mm -hmm. or even maybe a Rob, because like, what did he kind of messes up Rob? I can imagine it's not fun. Right. And then he I like, counter picked assuming. However, Raul going to his OG main heel. <laughs> well, not OG, but his actual but, main. But you, you get the drift, though. Yeah. All right. Good, good choice there. It's on gonna that be though. interesting to see though, because this is the first time in a while I think we've actually seen the DJP Rosalina. Yeah, and we also don't see the Raul Mewtwo a lot. All that often. Because right? we all play characters that kind of mess up Mewtwo. <laughs> um, but, important, but that down air, still very beefy, and it is going to stay spiked uh, Rosalina. Yeah, it doesn't really matter what hitbox he gets there at that point. The only He's going to get like hit. Yeah, the only way it couldn't be beneficial is if he got hit by the other side and he just went the opposite direction of the stage. Yeah. Like, just went like straight up into the air. However, oh, oh, Luma's dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Luma just kind of comes in clutch as the homie. So we're also going to see this being a much slower game than you might have expected, right. considering these two players. Yeah. Like, Both of mm -hmm. them have very kind of defensive, laid-back styles, I would say. They're much, they're much more about long-range yeah. pressure, and not so much in your face. Although, we say that, but right now, uh, DJP has actually had some very good corner pressure going right now. He's kept uh, Dinosaurus in there for quite a while, and yeah. he's still got him there. Thought he was dead for him, I know. No, he, he might have just wanted to go for the third jab there, because mm -hmm. Mewtwo's fight pure air dodge is amazing. Um, but what we're seeing here is that we're seeing that Raul is very patiently is working out for him. He's not really getting frustrated on that ledge, despite being there for an absurd amount of time. Mm -hmm. And we're seeing that the Rosa as a whole, while having that good ledge pressure, if you don't get antsy, she can't really just kill you. <laughs> she can right. do damage to you, but she can't just kill she you. She can get like chip damage at you, but like nothing that's actually gonna really kill you until it's much later. Yeah, like we're seeing like Mewtwo right out now. 150 max weight. Right. I don't remember against, the last time I, I saw Rosa. This. <laughs> yeah, like nonetheless. this is not something you would usually see, right. but most. It's really that defensive play style that's giving him the ability to just like not worry about getting hit. Ooh, I didn't know that. Actually, oh, nice call out. Yeah, and with Max Wade, that's gonna kill very, very early, especially at As the side oh, of the absolutely. stage. Oh, absolutely. Doesn't matter if you're on battlefield or not. Mm -hmm. I, I believe. I believe that the what the reason DJP threw uh, threw out the. Uh, Gravitational blows. I believe that the Dinosaurus had a half charge Shadow Ball in his yeah. pocket, which may not have killed, but it w still would have put him in a very bad situation. It's interesting to see the switch. Mm -hmm. um, I, think, I think this might be a little bit more of like a preemptive one. Yeah, come. and yeah. he did it right there. Um, right. I yeah. think uh, Danny's feeling a little, not feeling the, the most confident with his Rosalina today, probably. Yeah. I mean, go back to, gonna go back to the tried and true diddler. Yeah, he also got kind of got counter picked right off the bat deal. So that was that was a good choice on that. How uh, now we're seeing what we were probably expecting to see, minus the fact that Raul hates both of these characters. Right. <laughs> Although he did actually end up on town and city though, so yes. uh, beef with is gonna be extremely effective. Which is very beneficial because Rob as a pretty heavy body. Isn't going to be dying to Hoo-Ha, isn't going to be dying to up smash super mm. early. Well, Hoo-Ha doesn't really kill anymore outside like maybe like a 5% window on most characters. But yeah, I mean, Dinosaurus definitely is not going to be dying off the top anytime soon. Yeah. And that move right there, if he gets bad DI, will kill him right now. Oh, absolutely. And The so, way you DI Rob up, up there is very convoluted and silly. Yeah, and so if you're not expecting it, or if he like flips his body in a weird way, because I've, I've had it happen to me where they just kept floating one way instead of coming straight up at me, right. and I DI'd to the wrong arm. They're like, it's, it's the same thing as like with the uh, Sheik DI cross up where you'll, you'll start on one side, but then Rob will drift to the other side, and then suddenly your good DI becomes bad DI. Yeah, and it's not as str um, strong as the Sheik one, as like Sheik has a worse angle when you DI it back, but it's still just, it's not good. It's, right. not, it's not fun to have the DI against his character. It's not fun watching your character just get pummeled repeatedly in the air by a flying robot. 
Oh, that oh, should do it. That was excellent by DJP going Le for the monkey flip. Yeah, really good banana usage there. Yeah. Like knowing that he's going to land with a little bit of lag from that Ooh, nail. He actually dropped the banana to prevent it like a bee boop combo. Though I think that he would have been able to take that. Had he DI'd it, he would still be alive and he would still. He may have made that up ill. So, um, stale. However, right now, if he gets grabbed by it, he might just wow. explode. Wow. Danny is playing with house money right now. He's playing really well right now. Because like, not only not only is his banana usage and his placement just on point, but his follow-ups have just been immaculate so far. And we're also seeing him doing what Diddy can do to Rob, and that's just kind of like, oh, you want to play neutral? My neutral's better. Exactly. I mean, and like, what is Danny doesn't have to do much. He he has the lead, so he is he's in no hurry to actually go up to Rob. So he can kind of afford to just kind of hang back, play around the gyro and the laser a little bit because it doesn't actually matter to him right and now. And Danny has a very banana in hand Diddy style yeah. that we're seeing right here, and that he's just holding onto that banana, throwing it, re grabbing it, throwing it, re grabbing he's it. He's just kind of looking for you to hit a button. Yeah, it's a, a lot of it. Well, ooh. Okay, going for uh, that was an option. That's something I've seen uh, Dill do a lot, actually, at Xenos. So if he if he gets if he go, wants to go for the kind of read, yeah. that actually does a lot of damage and it can kill. Oh, it hits hard. It it, it hits deceptively hard. Though we'll see now that Rob's grab range is yeah. Even, I, even with that range, he still does have have kill options, and you gotta be careful of his grab at these high percents. Though we're also seeing most of that stock, especially once he got to about a hundred percent. Danny was just like, oh, Rob's grab range is atrocious. You're not touching me. Mm -hmm. And that was a very, very smart way to play, though right now I think he's getting a little bit antsy trying to get in right now because he's afraid bit. of this rage. A little bit, yeah. Just uh, He's already made up half this deficit already, so... Uh, you have to see. I mean, if the, 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 the lane, the keypad strategy was working because he had the stock but now that he's lost that stock, he kind of has to be a little more aggressive about it. Though, if he just keeps playing that keypad strategy, it would work totally fine. No, now he has to worry because about 40% eight, eight, out of about 80, he, that DI yeah, in Town City is going to start coming into play and yeah. he might just explode. Very well could explode right now, actually. Banana. This is going to become very scary for Danny the longer that he lets this go on. Yeah. One thing, though, is he's not really doing anything to stop, like, Gyro or prevent Rob from gaining, gaining access yeah. to it again. He's kind of just trying to play with his banana in hand, though that means he can't have Gyro. Right, he's... He, I think he's, he's he's kind of thinking, like, you know, my item is better, but in reality, like, Gyro is extremely effective. Yeah, like, Bananas may be amazing, but Gyro is fantastic. Gyro is probably also up there. Gyro is probably, like, within the top three of it's best probably the items. second best one. Yeah, because I'm don't i not counting needles. Needles are a projectile. Yeah. But yeah. We're, talking, we're talking pure items, like, Diddy Banana, yeah. Gyro. And then, like, Bombs. I was going to say Sawblade. Oh, yeah, Sawblade's amazing. Sawblade and like, Boomerang, or not Boomerang. Sawblade and Bombs are probably close to each other on the list. Though this is getting scaly. Yeah, this is. I actually, this might be 2%. It might be with this rage, if, especially if he just hits him with that up there, like he was going through Because he's at max rage. And, oh. Ooh, he got, catches the read. Uh, catches catch the, the roll with the up tilt. Nice. Yeah. But it, if he hadn't whiffed that, it was over. Oh, so I that had was the, a very big all nothing roll. I just realized I, I had the scores reversed, but. uh... It's okay, it evened out now. Sorry about that, guys. That was my bad. I actually... But uh, now the scores are actually accurate, so... Going 1-1 into game 3. Let's see... Now this is interesting, because now it is uh, Dinosaurus's counter pick. So let's see if Danny is actually going to elect to stay with there's his there's different... There's Mr. Chocolate from... Wait, After the dump. Wait, this is game 3. This yeah. is game 3. Oh. I, I miss... I you entered the score. The score. I, oh, I messed up the score. Yeah. That was my mistake. I didn't notice. Yeah. So... It'll be interesting. Are we seeing a comic book? I don't think uh, we I believe will. I heard them say that they're going to run back to town and city, but let's see if they're actually going to stay with these characters. It looks like they are. Uh, maybe not. I don't know if thinking about it. He, I know he won't go to mute here. He just, oh. oh. He's looking at him. He, he did it. do it. He did it. I'm trying to act like I didn't actually hear it. Like I'm not... 20 feet away from them. Yeah. <laughs> and I can hear everything, and they can hear everything I say. Though, I, I was lost by the fact that for a very long time, people thought that New Tuesday's matchup was Diddy. I think for a lot, they still think it's not a very good one, but obviously, like, Cloud has usurped that title. Yeah. Cloud has usurped that title, but it's still not a fun match. Right. Though, it's, it's still a very, it's still a struggling matchup just because of uh, Diddy 4 there. Though, I like the choice of taking Mewtwo to 
battlefield. Mm-hmm. Uh, as Mewtwo's very, very light, but now he's living longer, and Mewtwo doesn't struggle killing. Mewtwo yeah. just doesn't. He well, just you see, kills you. Well, see, normally I would say this wouldn't be a very strong choice against Mewtwo because this gives Mewtwo, like, so much room to do teleport cancels. But the thing is that as a player, like, Raul hasn't really used that many, done teleport cancel a whole lot. He so hasn't been does... doing it because he doesn't have, he wasn't using it against Rosa. Yeah. I know for a fact he knows how to do them and mm-hmm. is not afraid to pull them out. Mm-hmm. We haven't seen a whole lot, so I think that's why it might actually just end up working in uh, DJP's favor. Yeah. yeah. And, but we are seeing a lot of mileage out of Nail right now, right. and Mewtwo's not really a killable zone unless he gets a good up smash or something, mm-hmm. um, like a platform. But did he? Did he's gonna die if he gets smashed? Mm-hmm. No, like if he gets well, think the up tilt up smash? Well, I, this is probably a percent that uh, Banana to up smash, would, <laughs> both, both, both up smashes would would kill at this percent. Yeah. And I think that uh, Diddy has the Diddy advantage has much getting more. the up smash, yeah. yes. Well, also, he's not, getting, he's not really getting uh, Dinosaurus room to, charge, tele- sha- to yeah. charge Shadow Ball. Yeah. We haven't seen very much Shadow Ball this game, so he hasn't really, he's not actually, get, he doesn't really have access to one of his best tools in, in the moment. Ooh. But that getting the banana is going to get him kind of accidentally lands on the banana right in, in DJP's yeah. face. Definitely probably didn't want that one, but he was going to, oh, he's trying to get the banana filled up smash by the looks of it now. Unfortunately, just monkey flips right above it. Yeah, just slightly see? gets past. See, see, monkey flip is a good move. Monkey flip is pretty decent. He's, he's all right. It's all right. You want to see it sometimes, but not all the time. Up, up. Nice, and up he call out. He actually really, does a good DI. Really good DI there, though. <laughs> not what I would have. I wouldn't have expected him to live that, not gonna lie. Because, like, people don't live that. What surprise? Though, I'm starting to think not. not up throw won't kill yet. But back. Uh, th- this, is, this is definitely looking like up throw percent. Really? Yeah, really. On Battlefield? Yeah, well, he has rage. Okay, yeah, with the rage, yeah, I can see it. And, like, just as, like, a rule of thumb, the, uh. Ugh. Up throw, per, up throw starts working around like 120 ranges on most characters without rage. Okay, because see, like, I thought Battlefield has like, the Battlefield has like 5% roughly, but then rage reduces that a lot. But right now, he's just kind of getting walled out. He's been off stage for a long time this whole, for this whole bracket. And this and is, that right there is it. why we see that Diddy was for a very long time seen as Mewtwo's little matchup. Like, you can't get off ledge. Like, Mewtwo only has a really good off. Yeah, Diddy Diddy get off kinda, ledge, but Diddy just kind of does says not no. let you. Did he build? Did he build the wall that Trump pushes he could build? 